Alabama. It was a good game by Shaq Coatney, who scored 22 to lead Bellerman, but nobody else in double digits. As this team suffered from a couple of different maladies. One, uh, as, and we get to the post-game coaches interview here, presented by D. Scott Neal, a proud partner of Bellerman Athletics. I want to talk to Coach Chance Dugan about one. Gracie Merkel was not 100% today. She, You and I talked before this game. She is suffering from an illness, and you could tell she just didn't have the energy yeah, she when she was all. in there uh, and struggled a little bit in this Yeah, one. she really did. She, uh, you know, it was a tough game for her. Um, you know, they're, they're very, very physical with her. They don't let her move. You know, they wrap her, you know, on, the, on her legs and, you know, block her at her knees and stuff. And, you know, that's... That's the you know hardest part about being you know a post and being six six is you know you gotta you just gotta keep moving and you know that's it's it's very it's very difficult when someone's leaning on you yeah um, you know so I mean you know gotta gotta get that cleaned up I mean you know because the whole point about basketball is it's freedom of movement we're not playing football the, you know, the and, other uh, thing I was gonna bring out midway through the third quarter you lost Haley Harris yeah. to an ankle injury first things first is she how is she uh, how you know, how serious was I don't know i haven't gotten a report yet so i haven't talked to any of my trainers yet so i i, I really don't know you know it uh, obviously it's pretty serious if i haven't heard right. one thing from them yet right. so um i'm definitely concerned about that uh but it took the air out of the balloon yeah it really team. did really, we really playing did. well defensively yeah, we really were we were we were really doing some really nice things i i you know and it just i i think when you know when she went down it rattled us yeah. you know and and uh you know i should have called tom out you know just to just to calm him down but i mean they were just they were so rattled right. that uh you know just in seven people in you know just didn't you know didn't right you know we just turned the ball over more um you know so we've just we've we've got to be better than that you know we've got to we've got to you know, take care of the basketball when we're doing, you know, when when we're not, if we're not scoring, you know, if we're not getting shots, we can't turn the ball over. Right, you right, know? yeah, and, and when you're relying on your defense to lose such a key player on your defense, yeah. what Haley gives to you yeah. defensively is really missed when she's not on the oh, floor. Oh, yeah. yeah, you know, just, it doesn't show up in the stats or, you know, anything, right, you know, right. tangible, but uh, just her presence out there, you know, I think gives us a little bit of calming effect, and plus, you know, I mean, she's a great score for us, you right. know. I mean, so you know, we take you take that off the defensive side, you take that off the offensive side. It's it's pretty tough, uh, you know, to come back from, you know. But uh, you know, I will I will say that you know I thought Shaq played a played a great game. I thought Claire was really an unsung hero out there. I thought she did, you know, came up with a bunch of steals, right? Got her hands in there and you know and and, and did a good job. But uh, you know, you you've got to you've got to. It, it's just it's very Fight difficult. Yeah. yeah, it's very difficult. Yeah, it is when you don't have your leading score and then maybe your second leading score yeah. doing what they do out there. So um, you know we got to regroup and and uh, see what we got to do on, on the road here. Road trip, yeah. Yep. Liberty first, Queens. I would think you you want at least one of these two if you can't win both of them. Yep, for sure. All right, coach. Thanks, man. Good luck. Chance Dugan, the head coach of the Bellarmine Knights, as her team drops one here today at home, sixty six forty nine.